so if you guys remember, I believe it was in August, I did a consignment haul where I got Christian's car seat and uh, our double stroller, his swing, all of that. And it was time for it again for this year. No, I think this was the first one for this year. And I got some stuff, not as much as our very first time going there, but um, we find that Once Upon a Child is great for clothes. They're in great condition, they're, you know, reasonably priced, priced and all that. Where here, you just bring whatever, you put it on the rack with how much you want for it. And it kind of goes like that, which <laughs> I'm not a huge fan of that, but um, if you look good, you get there early, you can find some really neat things. The downfall to this is that if you're a consigner volunteer, you go before even the grandma and pre, um, I think it's pre-sale, it's called for new moms and it's for grandmas. Well, volunteers and consigners go before that sale, so all the good stuff is gone. So unless you volunteer or consign, you really can't find that great of things. So this is what we came out with. And, um... Besides his bouncer, it's just um, sitting there. So I'm gonna quickly take everything out of the bag and show you guys everything that we got. Okay, so this is everything. I try to put it in um, categories. But the first thing that we got is this Cinderella dress for Isabella. And this little guy is kicking me. You silly boy. Um, is a Cinderella dress for Isabella because she loves dress up. Um, and I like that it snaps here so that she's not all out there. And yeah, I think this is a... What size is it? It is a medium. So it should definitely fit her. And then, I don't have any prices on the stuff just because, um, they take the tags off, um, when you go to pay for them. But we didn't buy anything that was too crazy in price. Um, but this dr Old Navy dress, and it has just like little flowers. And this is a extra small. And it's not focusing. Don't mind my nails. It's extra small. And then this Old Navy jean jacket in a size small. it is just super cute and then they didn't really have much for boys like I said getting clothes there is not a huge success you are a much better off at once upon a child for clothes and but this was the one that we found it's nine months so it should be perfect um, it's six to nine which that should be perfect for the summer um, and it's just a little car and then it says captain on the shirt and it's just cute little overalls and then okay sorry about that my uh, mom called so Christian has blankets like he has the nice warm ones but he doesn't have thin ones so we found these and I think they're like they were two bucks or something which is not bad um thing I don't like is that the person taped them so I hope hopefully it doesn't leave any like sticky marks um but yeah, so we got two blankets for him, and then I was hoping to find a Minnie Mouse one, but they didn't, but she loves Mickey just as much, and it's just a little backpack, and um, a very small thing to like put little things in, and all of that. Um, yeah, I think this was like five bucks or six bucks, um, and she'll love it because it's a little backpack, and that it's... Minnie Mouse. I mean Mickey Mouse. And then the next thing are these rain boots, which they are not in the best of shape, but everywhere that I've looked for used rain boots, you can't find them really nice, like in good condition. And these are, um, I don't know what size these are, but I think they're her size. <laughs> they were in the bin, so I'm going to go with they're her size. If not, I can always resell them. They seem to be like they are her size or a bit bigger, so that's good. They're just cute little ladybugs, and I can wipe them and get them nice and clean. And then Christian doesn't have any hats, and we found just this one, and it fits him, um, and it's a little big, so hopefully it will 
<laughs> Hopefully it will work. And this little guy is going crazy. You're going crazy. Um, so let me quickly get through the rest of this. And then for Isabella, we got her a puzzle. She seems to like the puzzles with the little pegs better. So I found this one. I think this was like four bucks or two bucks. And it is the Serco brand. And then I really want to help her start learning her letters and everything else. And so I found this puzzle. It's a Melissa and Doug. And once again, I think it was like five bucks or four bucks. So that is not bad. And then for Christian, once, like I said, I'm going to wipe down and clean all of this before they use it. Um, that's the neat thing about stuff like this. You can put them in the dishwasher and perfect way to sanitize them. But he loves these links and these are like, have letters and different kinds of shapes so I know he'll love chewing on these and then um, all of this was in a little pack for like six bucks which is not bad um, and he loved it when I showed him everything um, so this little old ball car which I've been dying to get him that was my next purchase and it was in there so we got that and then he already has these and most likely I will not use these because um, he already has them and I don't know how I feel about teethers because you can't really put these through the dishwasher because they're um, the gel stuff so ugh. I'm just moving him closer because he's squirming he's a squirmer he's a squirmer <laughs> Um, yeah, and then this Baby Einstein little music box. Um, hopefully it works when I put batter new batteries in it. If not, I got gypped, but you live and you learn. And then this little, like, telephone. And so this works, so that's good. And then these two little balls were in here, which I can just clean up, and he might like them. I don't know. You like it. Just don't eat it. Here, let's put this over here. Um, yeah, so that's the toy stuff. And then he is using his Bumbo a lot more. And I was going to buy the tray. But when I went to Bye Bye Baby, they didn't have just the tray. Um, at least out. And so I found it there. And I think this was 4 bucks or 5 bucks, Something like that. So it wasn't too bad. It needs to be cleaned, of course. But... Yeah, so we're going to use his Bumbo more. And then I figured I would try a wipe warmer with him because he absolutely hates the wipes touching him. I can never get this thing open. Um, there we go. He hates, like, the, wet, the cold wipes touching him. So I figured maybe this would help him. And once again... Hopefully it actually works and I didn't, you know, get gypped. So the last thing is a big little thing here. Not very little. Um, and I'll open it and show you guys everything that is in there. Okay, so I kind of just took off all the saran wrap. Um, but yeah, it's supposed to be this neat little crib set. And it's supposed to have... A ton of stuff. It's supposed to have the comforter, um, the bumper, which we don't use the bumper on the kids, um, sheets, dust ruffle, diaper stack, and a mobile, which is right here. And um, yeah, and it has it's a little hamper as well. So there's that part. Like this is the first time that I'm actually opening it. Oh, that's so cute! It's a little tissue box holder. Oh my goodness. And this was only 25 bucks, so that's not bad. And then this here. Oh, it has outlet covers, little plugs. Um, I think this is the dust ruffle part. Um, like I said, this is the first time I'm opening it, so I have no clue. I believe these are the sheets. I'll open it completely once I take everything out um, as well. And then the comforter. That is adorable. I've been looking forever for his. And then the bumper, which like I said, we will not use that. Um, and the diaper stacker. Another dust ruffle maybe. I don't know. Aww. There's a little froggy. And a monkey. That is adorable. 
And then this is the thing for the mobile. And then it even comes with these little wall decorations. It has a little giraffe, a monkey, tiger, elephant, and a frog. And then it's a hamper. And I like the fact that it has like this mesh lining. It is ripped here, which I just noticed, but I think I can sew that no problem. Um, and the cover just goes like that. And I think, yeah, like this. And isn't that just a precious? So yeah, that is everything. I was gonna open everything, but it's just better not if I just leave it for right now. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe, follow me on Instagram and Tumblr and like my Facebook page. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. Okay, so it is the next day now, but I figured I would go into more detail about all of the stuff that came in the crib set. Once again, this is the picture of it. Um, but there was a lot more in here that I had no clue about, so I figured why not show you guys. So, this is the actual little hamper thing. And it just flips open like that, and it's a great size, and I love that there's the mesh there. So that you don't have to worry about if clothes are wet or anything. Um, and then it, this is the diaper stacker. Which is adorable. And then it came with the wall decal, like decoration stuff. Like I said, it has a giraffe, the elephant and the frog, little tiger, and a monkey. And then it had the tissue box holder, which is so cute. And then in the very bottom, there was this little frog stuffed animal. Um, let me put them back in here. And this little monkey one, which I had no clue that these were even in there. And then this is the dust ruffle. I'm not going to completely open it. Um... But there's a dust ruffle, and then I showed you guys the arm for the mobile, and this is just the actual stuff. It has the monkey, the tiger, a giraffe, an elephant, and the little music part. So that's in there. And then this is the balance for, like, the window. Um, I didn't even, I, I realized I skipped right over it on the list, but... The balance and inside of this bag are these adorable outlet covers and I think there's a switch cover too um, I can't get it open okay so there's these to go with it for the outlet and there's even one for the switch and then with that are these cute little outlet plugs. It is so cute. I had no clue that was even in there. Um, it is written down on the paper right here. Um, but I didn't read that. And I think that is so cool. And then there's two fitted sheets for it. And then the blanket, which I think I gave you guys a close-up. And then the bumper. But yeah, that was really exciting to find out that there was all this stuff. So I basically, for 25 bucks, created a whole nursery in a way. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, sorry to add this in at the last second.